Hi, Steve King again. There were a couple of additional things I wanted to point out about uh, using uh, process icons in PixInsight. One of them, sometimes you just want to have something in your icons where you may just want to have some instructions. How can you do that? Well, go over to your Process Explorer, open it up, go down to All Processes, and scroll down to N, letter N down here, and you'll see a no operation. Grab it and drag it over. This icon, it doesn't do anything, but you could use it for a set of instructions. So we name it Instructions. And in the description, let me move it up here, in description, open up description editor. And use this set of icons, you will need to create two clones of the target image. Name one of them O and one the other B. Okay, so people open the instructions and it lets them know that they need to create two clones and what to name them because you may have other things like a pixel math expression or something that's expect, expecting to see an image named O, maybe for original image, and one named B, maybe for a blurred image or something. So you can just use the no op to put down instructions so when you come back to your set of process icons later, you'll remember how to use them. It can be very helpful. Now, the second thing is you may want to include a script, a lot of good scripts that are available. I use a lot of them out of utilities. I use the uh, game script for creating uh, masks. I use the dark structure enhance to sometimes uh, change things. So if you want to use any of the scripts, you can't get to it this way, but you can get an icon this way. Going back to your process icons, let me close the all processes. So the first ones here are just my favorites, ones that I use all the time. If you go down below, you see one scripts. Open that up. Go down. In this case, say I want one out of the utilities choice out of the scripts. And here are all the scripts. So let's say I want to use the dark structure enhance. Drag it over. And now I have the dark structure enhance script. So we name it. That name's as good as any, so I know what it's going to do. Now, how do I apply that to this target? Well, I can open it up, double click, and then I can drag the icon over and apply it, and it will perform that. An easier way, the way I usually do it, grab the icon, left click, drag and drop it on the target image. Now it gives you all the options that you can change. For this one, I don't normally change anything. And I would just hit OK. And now it will perform dark structure enhance on this image. So you can always apply any of your icons. And there it's done. Don't see much difference on this image, but 
point was that's how you can apply that by moving it over. So just a couple more tips on things you can do. The no op for putting in instructions along the way if you want to. And drag well, creating a script by going down into the process explorer and down into the scripts. And dragging one, the icon over and just dropping it on the target image to have it start processing immediately. So just a couple tips. Hope they're useful. Thanks for watching.